Despite being born into wealth, John's childhood was bleak. He was a sickly child. He regularly suffered from brutal coughing fits, migraines, seizures, and various diseases such as scarlet fever. Hey, amazing creators. Welcome back to our editing universe. We're once again diving into the art of editing like Magnates Media. If you've ever wondered how to infuse that cinematic flair into your videos, you're in for a treat. So let me take you through the scene. A canvas adorned with the Morgan family portrait, a symbolic tapestry of history. A boy stands before it, a figure on the precipice of his own tale. As the scene gracefully zooms out, observe the magic unfold, layer by layer, while the text gently graces the canvas. All right, maestros, buckle up. We're about to set the tone for our visual symphony. Head over to CapCut. Import that soul-stirring audio file, our guiding star for this cinematic journey. Drop it onto the timeline and let the harmony begin. Time to infuse a touch of golden elegance? Head over to YouTube, search for Golden Dusk Particle Video and download the shimmering magic you find. This video is about to weave its spell as the enchanting backdrop for our scene. Oh, and don't forget to make the cut precisely at the five second mark from the start of our visual tapestry. Now, let's introduce the heart of our narrative, the family picture. Place it delicately on our timeline and mark a crisp cut at precisely 3.23 seconds. As it graces the stage, position it with finesse, setting X to U and Y to a gentle negative 221. But hold on, we're not done. It's time to play with the symphony of adjustments. Brightness takes a bow at negative 35, contrast steps forward with a touch of 5, and our supporting cast, Highlight, shadow, and illumination join the ensemble with a collective bow at negative 13. After that, let's sprinkle some stardust, a golden kiss of illumination. I've summoned a mesmerizing golden star video from the realms of YouTube. As it graces our creation, ensure its rhythm matches the heartbeat of our background image. Resize it to a commanding 385%, place it at the coordinates X to negative 1595 and Y to 369. A graceful pirouette awaits. Rotate it by 90 degrees and change its attire to brighten in our blend mode wardrobe and a touch of mystery with an opacity set to 46%. The golden dance begins, but our symphony doesn't stop there. Let's weave some magic in the adjustment realm. Set the temperature to 9, give the hues a brush stroke of 50, while saturation with a dash of negative 21. Brightness takes a bow at negative 9, Contrast steps into the limelight at 50. Highlight graces us with a touch of 10. Shadow adds a subtle whisper of 4. Illumination casts its glow with a value of 6. And finally, the vignette wraps it up with a gentle hug at 7. Now it's time to add some effect to it. The edge glow effect. Head to the effects chamber, nestled within the lens option. Here, we'll cradle the edge glow, infusing it with a luminous strength of 60. And send it behind the family image. Now, it's time to unveil our secret source for this magical concoction, the boy image conjured from the depths of AI using the mystical GenCraft. With a mere whisper of a prompt, kid from the back in a black suit with a round black cap, the AI weaves its spell, presenting us with the perfect image. To truly let this enchantment unfold, we summon the Remove.bg incantation, clearing away the mundane surroundings. Once the transformation is complete, we lovingly download and introduce it to the grand stage of CapCut. As we usher it into the timeline, we carefully position it, setting its coordinates to X, negative 64, and Y, 0. As our base scene nears completion, a subtle distinction separates the conjured realm from the actual one. Fear not, for we possess the remedy, the mystical brown lens forged in the sacred forge of Figma. Figma, a free UI UX and graphic design tool, awaits your arrival through the browser's enchanted gates. Begin this journey by traversing to Figma.com and embracing the first link that appears. Revel in the brilliance of Figma, where no special software is required, a sanctuary in the heart of your browser. Once there, click Get Started. Create an account. Once you are done with account creation, you will be redirected to the Figma interface. Now let's click on the design file and select the drafts option and find yourself on a vast blank canvas. Navigate to the top left corner where the shape tool beckons. Choose the ellipse, hold shift for perfection, draw an ellipse of 709 by 1073 dimensions, tinted in the hues of brown, and scroll gently. Under the effect property, bestow upon it the layer blur with a strength of 625. Behold, 
our lens is born. Now, let's export this enchantment into PNG format and usher it into the realm of CapCut. Should you wish to embark on a journey to master Figma, let your desire be known in the comment section. Gently lay the lens upon our timeline like a cherished relic from the mystical realms of Figma. Now, let us magnify its presence, scaling its power to a mighty 236%. As it gracefully finds its place at X to negative 1569 and Y to zero, witness the enchantment unfold. With a whispered incantation, set its blend mode to the ethereal screen, allowing it to seamlessly meld with the essence of our creation. Now, enter the Chamber of Adjustments, where the alchemical values of temp, hue, and saturation await your command each bestowed with the number 50, harmonizing the hues of our mystical lens. Embark with me on this animated voyage where the very fabric of our background video comes to life. At the genesis of our timeline, let the first keyframe of opacity emerge, a whisper of transparency set to 0%. As we traverse through time, let's fast forward 67 frames, guiding us to the second keyframe where the brilliance of full opacity, a radiant 100%, bathes our creation in luminosity. Now, let's infuse the enchantment into our family portrait. Initiate the dance of animation by planting the first keyframe for scale, delicately cradling the image at the outset, flourishing to a majestic 141%. As we journey 88 frames into our tale, a second keyframe takes center stage, gently embracing the image with a subtle scale of 90%. Witness the mesmerizing transformation of our family, a symphony of motion unfolding with every frame. Having orchestrated the enchantment of our family picture, it's now the Golden Star video's turn to dance with animation. Place the inaugural keyframe for Opacity at the genesis of our timeline, delicately set to 0%. As we traverse the temporal expanse, progressing 67 frames forward, we set the stage for the second keyframe. Here, the brilliance of full opacity, a dazzling 46%, comes forth, enveloping our creation in celestial radiance. Now, let's breathe life into our protagonist, the young lad in the elegant suit. Begin the enchantment with the initial keyframe, a delicate dance of scale and opacity. Adorning the boy at 181%, unveiling a subtle opacity ballet at 10%. As we traverse through the magical realms of 93 frames, a grander second keyframe steps into the limelight, the boy adorned in a scale of 123% and opacity crowned at a resplendent 100%. Behold the wondrous transformation of our hero, an ethereal ballet of animation that unfolds with each passing frame. Indeed, our scene is adorned with animation, yet a touch of magic is missing. Can you guess what it is? You got it right. The emergence of text and the underline beneath it, a duo set to elevate our creation. The text, crafted with finesse using Canva, is now ready to take the stage. If you're curious about the creative process, I'd recommend delving into our first tutorial. For now, let's place this text delicately on the timeline, gracing it with synchronization at 0.29 seconds to harmonize with the audio. Set its coordinates to X to 0 and Y to negative 45, and drape it in the enchanting blend mode of Brighton. Adjust the color symphony with saturation at 50, brightness at negative 15, contrast and highlight set to 50. Our trusty underline is poised to make its entrance onto the stage. Just gently place it at 1.06 seconds, allowing it to gracefully align with the other elements. Position it with a Y coordinate of negative 251 and maintain its X at the center, zero. Adorn it with a touch of saturation at 22, let it shimmer with brightness at negative 15 and dance in harmony with contrast and highlight, both set to 50. The moment has come to breathe life into our text. First, select the text layer and initiate the journey with the opening keyframe for the scale property at the very inception. Allow the scale to maintain its default allure. Now, let's progress forward 74 frames and unveil the second keyframe, setting the scale to a delightful 84%. Now, let's breathe enchantment into our underline layer. Begin with the first keyframe for the scale property, gracing it with an 81% charm. As we dance forward in time, Journey 67 frames ahead to erect the second keyframe, casting a spell with a scaled allure of 60%. The magic intensifies as we delve into the realm of masks, 
navigate to the Mask tab, selecting the Horizontal Maestro, directing it to a mesmerizing negative 90 degrees. At the very origin, where our first keyframe for scale resides, bestow upon it a companion keyframe for the mask's position. Here, conjure the coordinates, X shall be a captivating negative 16384, while Y unveils its mystery at a tantalizing negative 243. Glide 31 frames into the future and unveil the second keyframe for the position, unveiling the magic with X at a spellbinding 16384 and Y echoing in harmony at a bewitching negative 243. As we weave the final threads of our magical tapestry, let's bid adieu to our background. At the culmination of our timeline, bestow upon it the third and final keyframe for opacity. Journey 31 frames into the future from the second keyframe's dwelling and imbue it with the default aura of 100%. As we gently glide forward for another 13 frames, unveil the fourth keyframe for opacity, letting it descend to a mystic 54%. Let's start journey to the realm of our family image. Within the Mask tab, select Horizontal Mask. Grace the first keyframe upon the position and feather properties, aligning it harmoniously with the coordinates where the third and fourth keyframes of our background reside. Set X to zero, Y to a celestial negative 520, and let the feather unfurl to a full-bodied 100. As we transcend to the second keyframe, let the X maintain its ethereal stance at zero, while the Y gracefully shifts to the heavenly coordinates of 520, and the feather gently retreats to a delicate zero. Let us transcend to the domain of our Golden Star video. Within the Sacred Mask tab, opt for the horizontal mask, and allow it to gracefully pirouette to a celestial 90 degrees. Bestow upon it the keyframes akin to the cosmic alignment of our third and fourth keyframes in the background image. For the inaugural keyframe, ordain the coordinates with X bowing to a negative 127 and Y reverently genuflecting to the sacred negative 129. As we ascend to the second keyframe, let the X ascend to a divine 60 while the Y retains its sacred posture. Now, unfurl the same celestial script for the lens, yet in this cosmic ballet, alter the X to zero and let the Y bow in humble reverence to a negative 499 beneath the mask's sacred folds on the hallowed first keyframe. As we journey to the second keyframe, let the X retain its celestial constancy while the Y ascends to a divine 484, enveloped in the ethereal embrace of a feathered halo reaching a divine 100. Behold, the cosmic alignment of the script continues as we summon the subheading beneath the celestial underline into our earthly realm. This incantation is already inscribed, created with the rhythmic dance of typing animations on Canva. As we usher this sacred text into our timeline at 3.05 seconds, let the blend property be set to brighten, its scale ascending to 65%, its earthly position X set to zero, and Y gracefully bowing to a negative 383. A shift into the tempo as we engage with the speed tab, doubling the rhythm to hasten its divine manifestation. As we bring forth a seamless transition in our scene, to embark on this mystical journey, we beckon the presence of a stock video, a poignant portrayal of a tender soul. Fear not, for I shall bestow upon you the keys to these visual wonders in the description below. As we infuse this footage into the rhythm of our timeline and keep its length same as the length of subheading, let the first keyframe of opacity manifest at the very inception, veiled in invisibility with an opacity of 0%. With each fleeting frame, the spirit awakens, and at the 27th frame, behold the second keyframe, shimmering with an opacity of 24%, a mere whisper of its spectral grace. As we journey towards our last sign, unveiling the medical archives of JP Morgan, a transition is in order. To craft this passage, we seek the embrace of a wooden backdrop, a rich tapestry summoned with the keywords, the black wooden PNG. With this mystical material in our CapCut Sanctum, place it at 4.06 seconds. At the inception, command the positioning keyframe, granting it a Y-coordinate sanctuary at negative 2172. Venture forth, 27 frames into the future, marking the next keyframe, where the Y-coordinate ascends to negative 1324. Clone the essence of this wooden backdrop, creating a spectral twin to hover above the current realm. Inscribe the new destiny with a shift in position, 
The inaugural keyframe, stationed 15 frames hence from the Genesis, ascends to a Y-coordinate zenith of 2172. Meanwhile, the concluding keyframe, perched at the denouement, descends to the Y-coordinate haven of 780. This animated wooden backdrops are going act like a closing curtains which will set the steady and smooth transition between our two scenes. In our quest for continuity, we seek the same complete background for our current scene. To embark on this journey, navigate to the last keyframe of the wooden image. Engage with the more options nestled in the top right corner of the player, unfurling a tapestry of choices. Select Export Still Frame and delicately choose the sanctum where this visual treasure shall be preserved. Ensure the guiding light of Import Project is illuminated, heralding the arrival of this frozen moment into our CapCut realm. Drag and drop that imported still frame right after the wooden backdrop. In the jumbles of our creation, the medical report of J.P. Morgan, a crafted relic from the realms of Figma, finds its place at 4.23 seconds, extending its narrative until the final cadence of our audio symphony. As we breathe life into this parchment, let the dance of animation unfold. Place the first keyframe at the genesis, orchestrating the scale to a harmonious 100% setting its position at X to 357 and Y to 2340 and allowing a subtle rotation of 6 degrees. Traverse through time, marking the second keyframe 13 frames ahead, where scale remains steadfast at 100%, X and Y converge to zero and rotation gracefully returns to zero degrees. The grand finale awaits us at the precipice of our scene. Move 15 frames back from the finale, weaving the third keyframe into existence. Here. The scale sways to 137%, X echoes at negative 553, Y finds solace at 206, and rotation pirouettes to a gentle negative 16 degrees. On background layer, place the first keyframe for scale and rotation, orchestrating a dance where scale flourishes at 100% and rotation gracefully pirouettes to the default 0 degrees. As we approach the final crescendo, traverse 15 frames back from the conclusion, marking the second keyframe. Here, the scale unfurls to a majestic 100 of your percent, and the rotation gracefully bows to a subtle negative 16 degrees, bringing our visual composition to a harmonious conclusion. To add the finishing touch, we introduce a subtle yet impactful dashed line beneath the disease name, a stroke of detail crafted with finesse in Figma. Placing it delicately at the 10th second, scale this stroke to a modest 14%, position it with X at 926 and Y at a graceful negative 579, and set the rotation to a nuanced negative 16 degrees. To animate this stroke into the scene's narrative, initiate the horizontal mask feature, rotating it to a poetic negative 90 degrees. Journey to the stroke's origin, marking the inaugural keyframe for mask position, X delicately tuned to a negative 71 and Y gracefully set to 4. Traveling forward 13 frames, orchestrate the second keyframe where X mirrors its counterpart at 71 and Y harmonizes at a gentle negative 4, bringing this stroke to life in our visual sonnet. And there we have it, a symphony of visuals seamlessly orchestrated to unveil the intricate tale of J.P. Morgan's medical history. If you found this tutorial insightful, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe for more content, and share your thoughts in the comments below. For our avid learners, stay tuned for more tutorials, each unlocking the secrets of video editing prowess. Until next time, Keep creating, keep innovating, and let your imagination unfurl. Thank you for joining me on this artistic journey. See you in the next tutorial.